Hi everyone, and thank you for joining us once again here at SGTV. We are back with Tim Shaw yep. at your kitted out studio. Well, nearly kitted out. There's one bit of kit I've got to fit yet. Oh, and I've got to paint the walls over there. But anyway, this is the Recore IP and it is a uh, CCTV system. That's it, it's CCTV from the ESP part of Skullmore. Yeah, now the thing is, I made a specific point when I heard about this thing of wanting one of these and chasing this down because actually for me, reducing the amount of time it takes to install anything is a key part, but also making sure it's good enough quality. And the thing, the clue is in actually the two letters there, IP. So yes, it's- Do you know what that means? I'm gonna test you now. Internet protocol. There you go, yeah. I do know what that means, because precisely for that reason is why I chose it. And that means that, in fact, let's open it up. You can have one box, I'll have the other. You can have the, yeah, whatever's in that, I'll have whatever's nice. in my one. I'm hoping I've got the cameras. That's what we want. Because I want to show you something amazing about the cameras, which is, who got what? I've got the yes. NVR. Right, so you got the NVR, which is the network- Network video recorder. Video recorder. So that's the head of the unit. That's so this contains the hard drive. All the information goes yeah. to that. So if somebody breaks in, you want to see the footage, you get stored on that. But the thing that's amazing about that over other systems is quite simply the fact that normally with other systems, these things, the cameras, require their own power. Yeah. Which means you can plug all this stuff in, then you're looking around to put a few Thinking, spur where in. Can I take power? Where can I take a feed from? How do I do that? With this, you don't need that. It's one wire straight from that, straight to the camera, and that's the lot. Despite the fact that there is a power lead on there, this thing can get everything from the ethernet, can't it? Yeah, from Cat5, Cat6 cable. Yeah. So that thing there exists for what reason? So this will power the cameras up to 100 meters. Okay. And you can, if you want, power the cameras from there on right. using adapters and things like that. Or we do have other products, part of the range, that will extend your power reach. So we've got PoE extenders, we've right. got IP switches. So they can, again, eliminate the need for taking power from a local source. You can right. just extend it further. It's well made gear, actually. I mean, for me personally, as I say, the reason I got it is because I don't need that. So I could, in theory, snip that off. I won't, but it's all about that. That's it, yeah. And I love the fact, I, it's, an, it's an issue because you often compromise where you put your cameras, depending on where there's power. You don't just want to have to keep running power all over the place. So with this, you can simply go, where is the best place for the camera? That's the only consideration. And that's what's good about the system. That's precisely why I chose this one. Another thing is Ethernet cable, Cat5 cable. It's smaller. Yeah. So it requires a smaller hole for going in your walls yeah, and ceilings. Whereas yeah. shotgun cable, where you've got two cables yeah. with bigger terminated ends, yeah. can require a big hole, which, you know, when you- And it's nice just to see that good old friendly Cat5. Yeah. It's nice just and straight easy. into that bang. So installing of this system, how long would it take? Half let's, a day? Let's give it a go. Do you want to get it out and do we'll it? We'll get it out and do it now, yeah. Really? Yeah. Okay, let's do it. A little longer than a few minutes later. Right, so what have we got here? I'm going to turn it on. Turn it on. We're actually working. We turn it on now. I've got three cameras plugged in. Oh, wow. That's it then. There okay. we go. So, yeah, we've done simple install on the back, just your HDMI cable from yeah. your NVR to your monitor. You've got power to your monitor and power to your NVR. And then this is the bit we were talking about, so your right. Ethernet cables. Yeah. So on this one, you've got four LAN ports at the back. Yeah. And quite simply, we've just plugged them in and they're working. Simple as that. Yeah, you've got to do a basic setup for your account, like your, yeah. your name, your admin password, that kind of thing, but really quick to set up. And then it's it just a case of plugging straight in. It's the definition of then a plug and play. Exactly. With the kind of stuff you're plugging in and playing with is all cables we have in our houses anyway. Yeah. So no complicated fixing. It literally has taken us 60 seconds to unwind the, the ends, the tails from these you know, wires here, plug them in, Three of the four cameras, I mean, we can chuck this one in, but there's no point, you can see where that one goes. So everything's included in the kit. You've got your remote, your mouse, HDMI cables, ethernet, everything like that. Yeah. The one we've got, this is a four camera dome kit. Right. Uh, this one's in white, you can get two channel, you can get it in gray. Not only the dome, but there's bullet ones as well. Okay. So two, four, gray, white, bullet dome. Mix and match the way you want exactly, it. Exactly, yeah. Is this waterproof? Can it go outside? So the camera's are IP66, yeah. Right, great. Okay, so it's all encompassing. The whole lot you need right there in that box, dead easy to fit up. And you can also use your app. You've got the ESP View app, so you can do remote monitoring, see who's trying to break into your house. Now that we've actually opened this up and got going, I mean, I need like half an hour to get this thing up and running. There's no excuse for me not getting my kit, getting it up and, and being safe. Exactly. Yeah, let's get it done. Exactly, yeah. yeah. That's the Recall IP kit from ESP. If you want to see more videos from myself and Tim reviewing some of the products that have been featured in his studio, please make sure you like, subscribe, and hit the notification button below. <laughs>